I'm stuck here. I can't believe it. I'm stuck here as a substitute teacher only on call when I should be a star. The world should know who Jeanne Chambers is. But no, everyone knows my evil brother, John Chambers. Oh, John was the, the pretty boy. John had everyone on his shoulder. John was the athlete, the jock. He had everyone screaming his name. And they all forgot about me. What are you doing here? Class was over like four minutes ago. What? Oh. <laughs> Why, thank you. I got it, I got it from Macy's. I, huh? Oh. Well, pick up a chair. Well, you're kind of already seated, so just get comfortable. I guess we'll take it all back. Uh, we'll take it back from the first day it all started. Oh, when we were born! Mother never really truly loved me, but it's fine. Oh, because I'm going to make sure Mother understands who the real, true superstar of the family is. Who the real John Chambers is. Who the right brother is. It all started May 25th, 1954. It was a, a glorious day. I still remember it. Our dad, he had died in a car accident the day before, which is so tragic, because I never truly got over it. It's okay though, because I came along and I was born, and so was my brother. And all throughout our high school, while we were younger, heck, even when we was at grandma's house, Everyone made him cookies before me. Everyone paid attention to him before me. Everyone gave John Chambers more love than me. He was more popular. He was the cool kid. And everyone, oh, everyone just loved who he was. And then I came along. I was just the, the young brother who no one cared about the annoying little brother. But that all ends today. I am tired of taking orders from people who don't deserve to be in the position that they are. I am sick and tired of people ignoring me. I am sick and tired of people forgetting that I am great. Now granted, hmm, no one really knew I was great, but they will know now. They all will know. My evil, evil brother will know. The world will know. And my dead dad will know. Even, even my mama. My mama who did not care about me. My mama who forgot about me. It's okay. It's fine though. It's all good. Because when I take total control it will be glorious! <laughs> but wait, how can I do it? What was that? What is PSTV? That's where he works. <laughs> totally! Let's... Ah, uh, I know what we're gonna do. Maybe. Just maybe I could become a janitor and then I'm gonna slide on in and then I'm gonna take out all the cushions out of his pillows <laughs> and then when he goes to sit down on his chair with this pillow, it's gonna, it's gonna be no cushion. <laughs> Isn't that great? What? What do you mean I have to go bigger? and go better. That's the ultimate plan. He has bad back problems, huh? Mama's not gonna love him if he has a bad back! I know what I'm gonna do. I am gonna call it Operation Hostile Takeover, PSTV. 
V edition. Yes, I am going to band together. I am going to, I'm going to find a group of people who, who will, I can't find a group of people. No one really knows who I am. No one really is by my side. I don't have a friend. What do you mean you'll help me? <laughs> what do you mean you're on TPS TV? And you know the executive, what's his name? Ah, I have to write all this down, I must document it. All right, Operation PSTV, hostile takeover. I know I can't spell, I'm a math teacher. Plus, my mom homeschooled me from five to eight. She, she said I needed to stay home and learn how to do chores and, and clean and, and cook. Well, my brother just went to high school. Well, not high school, middle school? I don't really know, I don't know when it is. Anyway, let's, uh, you were getting off track. Operation PSTV, so. How are we gonna do it? That's a terrible idea. No! <gasps> I had another idea. Oh, I'm a genius. I should go out and be a sociological strategic planist. Is that a job? Eh, who really knows? And who really cares? Anyways, I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna email the executive producer because there's a, allegedly, I heard through the grapevine and through the streets that there's a live night coming up and it's gonna be live broadcasted to the whole entire world and that'll be the perfect opportunity. That'll be the perfect time for me to get up there and me to show the world that I can do it. Me to show mama that I can do it. And it gives me all the time in the world to show the world that John Chambers is not Jean A. John Chambers could never be me. John Chambers is not the superior brother. And what's your name? I, I kind of didn't ask you your name. What's, what's your name? You said Stan? Oh. Terrible name. I'm gonna call you Richie. <laughs> Richie and Jeanne. We're gonna we're gonna take over PSTV and we're going to be the power duo. What should I call the show? The Richie and Jeanne show? That's terrible. The Jeanne and Richie show? That's even worse. The JC show. What? I'll put you in the credit somewhere as like a side character or a host, but I'm the main guy. This is my takeover, not yours. What? What do you mean? What did this Jeffrey cough do to you? <gasps> oh my gosh. That is so terrible. He's an animal. He deserves the guillotine. But I don't know where to get one. So all we're gonna do is embarrass him too. He's not gonna play with you, Jefferson. Richie. He is not. And we're gonna take over and we are going to rule the entertainment industry. Because our names are Squimpy and Johnny Chambers. <laughs> Let the revenge tour begin.